The Kardashians are known to constantly bombard the headlines with the events of their life, and yes, we are back with another video looking into the lives of one special Kardashian member and her rumored love interest. Hey Philip Gossip lovers, and welcome back to Trend Craze. We all know who Kim Kardashian is, along with her famous family, that the paparazzi are always ready to attack and squeeze out the juicy gossip from. So, let us take a quiet snoop around what Kim Kardashian has been up to during the lockdown. Everyone was spending time during the lockdown with their family, trying to make the most out of it. Unfortunately, we cannot say the same about Kim Kardashian and Kanye West, as they had bigger problems to deal with. A divorce. So, is Kim Kardashian actually getting a divorce from Kanye West? In complete honesty, Kim is known for her poor history in marriage and men, but her marriage to Kanye was one that was looked up to by all in the industry as well as the fans. But the rumors are true that the two of them are going through a divorce and are no longer in direct contact with each other. In fact, Kanye moved out of the house during the summer last year to their farm in Wyoming and cut complete contact with the entire family. But what was the reason for the divorce? We are all quite aware of Kanye West's poor mental health, the most recent example being the one at his presidential campaign after which he completely cut off everybody and moved to Wyoming. It was quite a tough time for Kim and the rest of the family, but this was when the situation had gone out of hand and she had reached her saturation point. She took the bold and scary move of filing for a divorce after being married to him for six long years and sharing four kids with him as well. The two of them have handled the divorce as smooth as they could and have stated the reason for their divorce as irreconcilable differences. There is probably more to that word, but guessing from both as the parents' protective nature, they didn't want any of their kids to be affected in the process. With all that drama going on for quite some time, does Kim have a new man in her life? Rumors have been blowing up the internet with regard to Kim and Drake having kindled a love interest, which till now neither have claimed to be true. All we know as of now is that Drake has his eye on Kim now and has been doing so for quite some time. Not gonna lie, but who wouldn't want to date Kim Kardashian? So, what exactly is going on between Drake and Kim? As of now, they both are leading their own lives, but Drake seems to be hell-bent on hitting it off with Kim Kardashian. Though we cannot state clearly if he is doing it for the money or fame, many are stating that this is being pulled off by him so as to get back at Kanye. Yes, it is true, Drake really loves drama, and we highly doubt that he will stop his attempts at creating havoc, especially when things have gotten so heated up with Kim and Kanye's divorce and the paparazzi being fully aware of his love interest. Is it true that Drake and Kanye were best buds in the past? Kanye West was one of the role models and most influential people in the music industry that Drake looked up to while entering the field of music. In fact, back in 2008, Drake was trying so hard to meet one of his greatest role models. They did meet and did get friendly. They even worked on some music together. Drake's song, Find Your Love, was one that Kanye helped produce, but following this, the relationship between the two took a steep tumble downhill. What went down between these two rappers? In 2010, someone released a segment of the song All of the Lights by Kanye West, which contained Drake featuring on it too. But when the song was released, there was no trace of Drake on the track, leaving all fans to wonder what went wrong. This was followed by Drake being spotted with Amber Rose, who happens to be Kanye's ex. At this point in time, the entire world knew that a feud was just building up. The media further acted as a stimulus by taunting the two of them about the feud through an array of rumors, most of which weren't completely true all the time. This was followed by Drake dissing out at Kanye and speaking about his collaboration on a new album with Lil Wayne. Drake publicly stated that his idea of a collab was being aped by two other rappers in a very discreet way. The public instantaneously understood that he was referring to the album collab between Kanye and Jay-Z. Drake even stated that he wants to be better than Kanye West and even went to put it as one of the verses on his song, I'm On One, which was a collaboration he had with DJ Khaled. This was not the end of the feud as in 2018, one more scenario arose when Pusha T and Drake were involved and dragged Kanye West into it as well. Later, Kim Kardashian did come in to support her husband and tried to shut down the lies with her truth. 2018 was also the year when the infamous Twitter feud between Kanye and Drake was making headlines all over. The threat of rants involved Kanye calling out Drake for offending him by using his brand negatively on his track, No Stylist. Kanye kept going at him on Twitter until Drake called him and threatened him 
following which Kanye posted another tweet stating that Drake would be the first suspect if anything had happened to him or his family. Kanye also called Drake out for being insensitive towards people who suffer from mental health issues. Drake chose to cool the whole scenario by laughing it off, but seems to be taking revenge for that now since Kanye is soon going to be out of the scenario with Kim. What was Drake's recent shade thrown on Kanye all about? Drake came out with a new single titled Wants and Needs this year, on which he makes yet another Yeezy reference, which was bound to tick Kanye off and he knew it. The Yeezy reference involved Drake wanting to confess to Jesus about his sins, but that he wouldn't be believed even if he spoke the truth. This arose a lot of speculations everywhere, and people were trying to decipher what this cryptic message meant. Many claimed that this could be some link up that he may have had with Kim Kardashian in the past that Kanye wasn't aware of. Phew, the rumors seem to be getting hotter by the day. What does Drake have to say about the divorce? Drake has openly stated that he always felt Kanye wasn't the one for Kim. He also added that he is glad that she's finally come to her senses and has been awoken by the truth of this man. Has Drake made a move towards Kim? Drake has been rumored to have slipped into Kim's DMs recently, but what the content was and what her response was is not known to any of us as of now. He has also stated that he would do so officially once the divorce proceedings are out of his way. The man is truly waiting for a golden chance to get back at Kanye, and he is taking this chance to his benefit in the stealthiest way possible. Do you guys think Kim would feel the same way back? In complete honesty, Kim is known for her poor history in marriages and men. This is one reason why many feel she may actually go ahead in this direction after the divorce is finalized. But after the arrival of her kids in her life, she has seemed to turn into a more mature individual and has become quite careful in the endeavors she gets associated with. This is one reason why she may actually just choose to focus on herself and her kids as well as her business before she gets back into the dating game. Though this may seem too soon a time to move on, a rebound, need for attention, or just the need of a friend may result in her indulging in Drake's affair as an impulse. Or this may even occur due to the not-so-smooth divorce that Kim and Kanye have been covering up as a smooth proceeding. So wait, isn't the divorce case playing out smoothly as stated by the news? That doesn't seem to be the case, and you would agree too after you hear this piece of information that certain sources have confirmed to be true. Kanye and Kim have no contact with each other, and Kanye has even gone to the extent of changing all his phone numbers. The only communication the two of them have is through their security. They both have decided to co-parent the kids, and Kanye and Kim are not in the presence of each other when this is being done. Unlike most divorces that involve feud over money, this one didn't at all thanks to the conditions of their prenup. However, they did face issues while splitting the house, but that was dealt with too. We hope you had a great time with us today, and we can't wait to have you guys back on our channel real soon. Before you carry on with the rest of your day, do make sure to strike the like and subscribe button. Do tap the bell icon while you are at it so as to be alerted of our new content immediately every time we post something new on our channel. Sayonara ladies and gentlemen.